Can I hear your voice in prayer? Shade bada da da koda na 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 kafira kesha rabada bahanto salama zia ante de 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 balo kolo bosha ke para da da bando ke fere na mosh asigere de boho ya anta rada da ba shaya kalando ke bara do salama ante rabada ko salada da. Let the redeem of the Lord say so. Sheremando Ziaka Rabba de Colam Teredesha Lea Anto Zilia Harash. Hallelujah. Great are you, Lord, greatly to be praised, greatly to be praised. Father, you reign, great are you, Lord, greatly to be praised. And greatly to Father you reign. Oh great. You are greatly to be prayed. And greatly to be prayed. Father you reign. Great. Arabashanada. Father, you. Father, we honor you for your faithfulness. We have no strength of our own. We humble ourselves before you, sweet spirit of God. You are the healer. You are the liberator. You are the emancipator. You are the lifter up of hearts. We ask you in the name of Jesus, since we are still men and women under construction, work on us. In the precious name of Jesus, as you prepare the church, the bride of Christ, for his second appearing, I come against every satanic order. I rebuke the presence of evil. I silence the voice of the adversary. Roar like a lion. The lion of the tribe of Judah. Save the sinner, reclaim the backslider. Let tonight be the night the miracle begins in the lives of your people. Take all the glory. In Jesus' precious name, amen. amen. Clap your hands. <laughs> Hallelujah. Great to see all of you. Forgive my voice. We have been traveling in prayer for some time now. Hallelujah. John chapter 12, verses 20 and 21 is our foundation scripture. The Bible said there were certain Greeks among them that came up to worship at the feast. The same therefore came to Philip, which was of the side of Galilee, and desired him, saying, Sir, we want to see Jesus. The same therefore came to Philip, which was of the side of Galilee, and desired him, saying, Sir, we want to see Jesus. We came to see Jesus. We require, we desire, we request, we place a demand to see Christ. Luke chapter 21, verses number 34, 35, and 36. I said, arguably, this is the most relevant verse of scripture in the times in which we'll leave the Bible. It said, take it to yourselves. Lease at any time your hearts be overcharged with suffering and drunkenness and the curse of this life. The Bible said, and so that they come upon you on a worse for us a snare, it will come upon all them that dwell on the face of the whole earth. Watch ye therefore. Pray always that ye may be accounted worthy to escape all these things that shall come to pass and to stand before the Son of Man. Watch ye therefore and pray always that ye may be accounted worthy to escape all these things that shall come to pass and to stand 
behold the son of man since i would love to carry everybody with me allow me to read this particular one in our language look at some picture do you know back up he more yet your son nine a pim at your sense yet if you actually know said coco but was more him who you know put on and on some brown and came with that you know one year man how i'm sure my class with the baby but i'm a two free music for the was here baby when you're tears i see many soon to move me monster to be on when you're more than the journey of free name a baby name on my coaching out when you pop on any may the lord bless the reading of his word you may be seated in the presence of god whilst i do a very quick revision good evening to you let me first apologize for my late coming uh you know that god has given us a mandate at alabaster city and uh, we are pursuing that mandate as well and so um having to leave that place uh late now uh, got to go through the traffic vicissitudes forgive me um having said that i welcome all our friends online on youtube podcast uh facebook and the rest of them i salute all of you thank you very much in a precious name of jesus let me do a very quick revision and then i will salute all of you very well and then we can cruise we're still close on time do you know that today is uh, may 23 year 23 so 23 23 the month of may so let me put it this way, 23, 5, 23. Anybody who studies uh, biblical numerology will understand that it today, today has a very, very solid prophetical value. That if anybody is believing God for anything whatsoever, today can be a day of possibility. Amen. Today can be a solid day of possibility. You will be to me a book when you to find a baby. I dear, what come in a net here? As my make can would you? I'm a GI. What do May I speak to somebody who uh, you know you have been through a time of uh, so many events have de delayed in your life? I declare from tonight the delay is over. Praise the name of the Lord. Every desire, any request, whatsoever you are believing God for, I declare in the name of Jesus, there shall be a performance. If you are trusting God for a door to open, I declare it is open. Amen. You are believing God for healing. It is done. You are healed in Jesus' name. I declare that in the name of Jesus. Not by power nor might. By the time we leave here, God will give you a miracle. Hallelujah. Praise the name of the Lord. Second Samuel chapter 1 and verse number 19. In my submission last Sunday, we came to a very solid conclusion that I would love to, as to, uh, you know, go through so that all our lovely friends who are not here, we, my subject actually on Sunday for the past two Sundays to, through to the next three Sundays actually are the cities of apocalypse. I said that apocalypse are uh, mysteries or revelation or something that is concealed that is that must be uncovered or unveiled. Now, um, there are some scriptures that we read. Second Samuel 119 is one of them. The Bible said the beauty of Israel. As a matter of fact, this scripture, the preamble to it or the introduction to it was when the, the death of Saul, the king of Israel, was announced to David who had taken over as king. When it was announced to him, this was his response. He said, the beauty of Israel is slain upon the high places how are the mighty fallen tell it not in god publish it not in the streets of ashkelon least the daughters of the philistines rejoice and least the daughters of their uncircumcised triumph he had mentioned some cities and here i was making 
um, I was making a recreation to or the reference to some of the cities that the Bible mentioned that has some lessons for this generation. For example, Matthew chapter 11 verse 22, as a matter of fact, from verse 16, Jesus asked, to which should I compare this generation? And then when he goes down to the next verse, he, he mentions, and uh, we have piped for you, and you did not dance. We have mourned for you, and you did not lament it. So he goes further and said, uh, for John came neither eating nor drinking, and you said that he had a devil. And then he said that uh, the son of man came and eating and drinking, and you said he is a friend of the glotios and the one by Bible. He's a friend of the publicans and sinners. But wisdom is justified of her children. And then Jesus went further and uh, he rebuked the cities, you know, where he had done most of his mighty works and deeds. And so the Bible said he began to abrade, abrade them. In the next verse, he said, uh, concern, he said, Woe unto you, Chorazin and Bethsaida, for the mighty works which were done done and you were done in Tyre and Sidon they would have repented in sackcloth and ashes in other words he has also mentioned certain cities now here I was talking about there were certain cities of apocalypse here Chorazin, Bethsaida, Tyre and Sidon then he went in further in verse 22 and talk about uh, it will be more tolerable uh, for, for Tyre and Sidon than for you in the day of judgment he had mentioned the day of judgment. There is a day of accountability. I wish the leaders of Africa will understand that. There is a day of accountability. It's a day of reckoning. I'm telling you. Taking fans and giving it to young girls who have not. The younger ye girls here, you know, who were sleeping allegedly with the Binkum Secondary School headmaster has been able to sleep with 15 young girls in his bungalow. What are you going to say? Obakusku. A headmaster said, Obanomen wakukun timanini. Asiye juma se. Diya wo kani mum ena wo wo problem. Anu kufiu dro no ye huayi. Sa wo ma me juma. Wo ma biya wo ma me juma nene ni jidi ye me ye no. Ya wo ma me juma. Uni ana di si biya o wo kumasi ye chiyo. Wo ko buru ne si bi wo hospital. Enna mse. Oni ne penye nyakasa kasa at work. You will not believe that this, you know, has been reinstated after his suspension. I'm catch also young was here, you man yin. Timia chire chire uni pe young was here, you man babu mwa, you who are tia wom tin wom kao misikwe. Ti mo bua nwa na hete. And the Ananum Medicine and Grow for the three billion people have used three billion dollars to, you know, build the Dubai waterfronts and refurbish cities, build something that can last significance. Mufriji lo in yene. Otemukan can only add dear contain the stay bruce on omni adia. Therefore, he is speaking to those cities. Osimuni. Isaiah chapter 5, he was talking about stuff like that. Dear, dear. It started from verse number 14. Let's read from there. Isaiah the fifth chapter, the 14th verse. The Bible said, therefore, hell has enlarged itself and opened her mouth wide without measure. And the scripture said, and their glory and their multitudes and their pomp and he, the Bible said, that rejoice that shall descend into hell. Can I read this in my language, please? And 
dom tie yi ni padom ene wonwa tie ene wonwa won ni ka hell ya won ni power as as so awon ma ni ka hell o ma ni john that was what he was talking about in uh, john chapter 3 verse number 19 was a higher baby as in suni padusum light has come into the world but men love darkness rather than light di obi sori betena so ndema ye nkekan kwasi asem njeda speak the mind of god preach the word the bible said preach the word not nonsense kasi an sori aye ga na hamma ne nipa jimi an omu jimi people who have no business with the gospel jimi an omu jimi This is why honesty, diligence, truth cannot be taught. Cannot be taught. Me, he said, listen to this. Apart from hypocrisy, apart from hypocrisy, apart from hypocrisy, I'm <laughs> and happen in a can see when i will flip here about a bus international school and now a bus international ministry that child is mine in fairness i will but no when you will buy me back as long as that person is in this particular commission or you may buy i pick responsibility of that child it will be a headmaster would take your responsibility Tell me, T, I know what you're doing, but you're saying. Mama, this is what you're saying. I'm going to make you and I will go for you. What kind of irresponsibility? See, this was what I was talking about on Saturday. There is no order, no structure, no responsibility. The generation is refusing to take responsibility. You know why? The Bible said the heaven of heavens belongs to the Lord, but the earth he has given to the sons of men. But the BSC will have near the Akoshi Yami. Yam Fan Shinyami and near the Akosha Bonsam. So many people are lazy people. Big, they are waiting to come and beg. I'm telling you that church is not a religious center. You have come to a training camp. You are here for your marching orders. The Bible said if you examine yourself, nobody will judge you. That word examine yourself, if you scan yourself, nobody is going to judge you. Scan yourself. So David says, search me, O God, and know my heart. Try me and know my thought. If there be any evil way within me, and lead me into the way of everlasting. We and what's we? We better not send them. I can't reach it. So the child that came to church is my child. I rebuke you. I correct you. I love you. I don't take advantage of you. Tina better not have that be a macacho. So from Jimper, I saw the man she shall tear the how many times have I made the statement? Countless times. 
Some of them, we, we went out there, preached the gospel, went to secondary schools, went to universities to preach to people and to, you know, ask them to repent and to come to the saving knowledge of Jesus Christ. Their names have been written in the book of life. The Bible said in Matthew chapter number 28 verse number 19, we should teach them. We are teaching them to observe all things whatsoever that he has, you know, commanded us and lo, he is with us. Whilst we are doing that, the person is baptized, the person has received the Holy Spirit and you know they are receiving training in righteousness. Now when you be and an uncle chum prakan kano says how cranoa yako yino no can you imagine that o cranoa why yiran why the the soul that was was condemned to eternal damnation no? is the person you want to abuse that is very interesting. Sofu mami o hona sofu ni ubi nyam. Ubi yedin en sabe toso. Bibisia e yabe ye. Period. I'm telling you. Transference of spirits. Demonic spirits. Udi ya ni namni enfe en zanto toso. Chini na be mron sami omon form on santo toes. Wani man ko ye ma dada ye hu e hu no mo ba so to out. Ko one time. Me say, me dey back cross sorry I could Jimmy the enka medical kuntada. I'm telling you. I believe in signs and tokens. I believe in, you know, points of contacts of the Holy Spirit. I believe in emblems and all those things. You know, I believe in it. But I don't believe in nonsense. The fact that you are a Christian doesn't mean you've lost common sense. Your human dignity that you have. The Bible said there is a spirit in man. The inspiration of God gives them understanding. And then had you understanding one year. Where is your understanding? Put that scripture there so we can follow. Job chapter 8 and verse number. Uh, 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 let, let's begin from verse 6 and read from there. Job chapter 32. The Bible said down. Uh, move to the next verse. Let's go straight to that one. Next one. Job chapter 32. 32. Focus, my darling. We are me very for. Yeah, we are me very for. Next one, please. The Bible said there is a spirit in man. The inspiration of the Almighty gives them understand. Put this in a different version. In this version, interestingly, look at this. The Bible said, but it is a spirit of Almighty God that gives us, gives that that comes to us and gives us wisdom. Do we jina yana mekajo zobi yamva kropoto mrano onswa sujegu papam nefesu apampe. Next version, please. In this version, interestingly, the Bible said, but there is, there is, there is a vital force and a spirit of intelligence. I like this. I like this. Intelligence in man. With the Ghana to two scripture, we want. me we say we are far away from it. Where is intelligence? Check it free at your Right down to Adabraka. All the gutter culverts. Scraps for not to tune in. From Achimot. I intentionally drove. I may check it. Check it. It's It is more yeah, but ton scraps on our mama. Don't you have intelligence? So a dear way a you are mine there. It belongs to the state. Me say, me mfangu wa fodi ya nka abe bwone nyomre. Prichi nwe eme ni pejwa. Fa fodi ya no. Uku ya. Maamibi ikambe mkuni tebla api ya wakwa nyesa. Jibi. 
iniquity. It's a spirit of ex intelligence. Spirit of intelligence. A then a power. A deso. A kwe we ya won ni me jadi ye. A ye then would me kum by your chemist. A product of the University of Ghana Legon. A siye won no won in fichi. And ye gana police service yanka. Na ye nim se ni pami and san social. He die and will be away at university. Once believe can even believe. Say you boost come. You boost come one come here. Come and board you. Come and find mommy offer us. No, no swan. No, any man come and for. You boost come. Kwabrani be sister baaku. You know, lives in America. Works three jobs. Brought money and said, "Me kulo mu hine di mi jini di." Nana J. The fire me project him. I'm not an addis can a drua and cry her so to so be born. You are standing in an office of trust. The woman believes you. Dear dear make when you are with Shiloh, the Bible said in the book of um, Ecclesiastes, God has created man perfectly, but the men have sought out many inventions. The many inventions is what is driving us all crazy. It's driving us all we'll, we'll and wash the shit, wash the shit, according to the will of God. May say, you will not have problems. One, say, but someday, but the Lord will block him. I'm telling you. I tell you, watch the snares and the traps that have been set for you. Let your ways and your walk with God be ordered by the Holy Spirit. Don't expose yourself to dangers. You marry a fool, you will struggle. I am telling you, I can prove with scriptures. I'm telling you, I can prove with scriptures. What the police were drum with the one my one or ye jimmy for? What we ain't be being ye for a comma comma no well be who A young lady got married from this church. At the moment they are in court, they, they've divorced. I brought them to my office to let to know what, what is it? A dear, what is it? The young man sleeps with this girl six times in a night. Are they? Are they? At the end, I want to ask you what pursuit. At the end, I pursue too. At the end, I pursue too. At the end, I pursue too. Fit a four crew to both to a not to our moment. Second Chronicles chapter 27 verse number 6. A king by the name Jotham. The Bible said prepared his ways before the Lord his God. Second Chronicles 27 and verse number 6. Second Chronicles chapter 27. The Bible said so Jotham became mighty. Because he prepared his ways before the Lord is God. Turn it to a different version. The Bible said he grew powerful because he directed, he, not the Holy Spirit, Jotam, Onua Meki, certain prioritized principled decisions, spirit led. Purpose driven decisions, not taking any day as it comes. Prepared his way. I mean, there, there should be a plan. There should be a plan. Not la ba ba So what is what is the, 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 the Lord is with us? The Lord is with you. Even the devil knows the Lord is with you. 
What is the plan? What, what is the plan? You want to marry me? I think I'm writing a book I'm, I'm about the latter stages. And the book is 30 questions every single lady must ask before accepting a proposal. And one of those questions is, what is your vision? What is your vision? Not do you have a Mercedes? No. What is your vision? There must be a plan we are following, Anna. What is your vision? Where are you going so I am for I have to be following? What is your vision? Where are we going? If the bus is not going anywhere, then I'm not going anywhere. So what, where are we going? What is your vision? In the echo. I think that that is what a young lady, one of the things that she should be mindful of. This is why when people bring young men and say, this is the guy who wants to marry, I have a lot of questions. I have a lot of questions. Are you born again? Is one of those questions. Are you saved, washed in the blood? Are you filled with the Holy Spirit? Questions like that. Who is your pastor? No, who is your pastor? No, I asked all more yet. Where do you fellowship? I sorry Ben that we didn't woom. Oh, maybe I sorry the me didn't be be a me didn't be be a. So any part we 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 didn't see we no. Then you are my friend. I could have Oma. You are my friend. Oma. We could have Oma in a day. Oma for any year. We didn't be be a. There are young ladies. I mean, the young girl, she said to me, Papa, don't stop my decision. I said, why? She said, I can't do it. She said, I had a miscarriage. And my husband didn't even know I had a miscarriage. The guy doesn't care. We've been married six months. We couldn't mark on her mother. Don't stop my decision. I made a decision. So let's have a conclave, a family conclave. You, family, your parents, this, his parents, come together. From that time, the young girl decided to stop this church because she doesn't want that meeting. She knows that that meeting is just to... to to push a, a, a conclusion that, oh, let's, let's work it out. Let's, yeah. She doesn't want it. Bema we or Jare, he is sick. He needs help. He needs help. We need to deflate it. Say amen. Tonight, instead of the questions and answers, I want to pray for you. Let's, push, let's postpone the questions and answers to next week. Let me usher you into a realm of the supernatural and uh, miraculous. Let God open doors for you and help you from May to June to December. Amen. Yeah. So, few minutes we have, let's make use of it. Let me tell you something. If you align your, if you prepare your ways before Christ, you don't need to fight spiritual battles. The battle belongs to God. He will fight. That one is the proper, the battle belongs to the Lord. God will fight. It is not a slogan, no. the battle belongs to the Lord. No. The, the battle belongs to God when the people have your heart and clean hands not just slogan battle belongs to god no scripture the bible net the whole be it can be i mean louis farrakhan is a very good bible student be it me preach you by you know farrakhan can speak for three hours you will not blink you will listen you will listen the, ba the battle belongs to the people that the Bible said that the Lord will fight for the righteous. 
trying to try to touch the righteous and see what God will do. One thing I'm telling you, Obi nye onwa di enko den ifi ti di amekan. Allow God to fight for you. Don't, don't try to interfere. The ways are prepared on it. Let's go back to the second Chronicles chapter 27. And uh, you know, he prepared his ways. Uh, give me three different versions and we are close. Uh, this one says he grew powerful because he faithfully obeyed the Lord his God. Went to a wedding, you see bridesmaids, bridesmaids, shabbat to their to their drawers. I saw a pastor's daughter's wedding. I cried. It was left for her nipples to just fall out. Pastor's daughter. What is wrong with us? Fully obeyed. Faithfully obeyed the Lord. Obeyed God. And she said, I'm going to try to obey my man. I'm going to say, I'm going to pay in America. I'm going to say, I'm going to say, God will not cast his, his rubies upon the swine. His pearls, his gold, his treasure will not be displayed before the pigs. God is a principled God. He will bless you in, uh, for your obedience to his word in faith with Christ. That is what he will do. Not, not just, you know, anything. Every day, every day, this 24 hours that has passed, 24 hours of your life is gone. Now you are having gray hair. Oh, that's a statement. It's a statement. Please don't waste your life. Don't waste. That's for the breakthroughs I have tell you. Mama, comfort. Bless you with cars and houses and all that. Those the fatwa, fatwa. They are your tools to make you successful. I realize that especially before oh, ni say. Last year, Mrs. Suriname, Fawon Tonneso, is here in Yansa. This year, Mrs. Bate Urade, Tia Futu, Necosus in Yansa. Bate Urade, Fawon Bate Urade. Nitia Futu, I'm not talking about a no one in Chia Futu, Bible Mufutu. Tia Futu. No Kokwanans here Futu, Tia Futu. Godly counsel is what I'm referring to. Nekosusie nyansa. Na monu anu ya ne mame emedi. Oye du ya ni shishe fridge mnu esine ne ema. We've been doing this for four years now. Me I was so far. I love you. I can tell you anything. Even if I tell you when you leave church, it's fine. I have told you, Minu Muja Unfo. But, Ubi be bregwa unho. I always use this as an example. I go to Silverstar, I want a Mercedes S Class S600. They give it to me. I said, I want to test drive the car. I take it around the N1. I said, I didn't feel it on the N1. I want to take it to Tamale. And they call me, I say, well, I'll come tomorrow, I'll come next week, I'll come next month. It's been three months I'm driving the Mercedes. I bring it back and they said that the, the cost of the car actually is $150,000. I said, I didn't really feel, I think I, will, I like the gene wagon. Can I test drive the gene wagon? What you car wait three months? Untiaka. In wagon. This is what is going on. These young men can see church girls, daughters of Zion, 
They take you relationship, you cook for them, you wash for them, you sleep in their house, they sleep with you, and all that. You get pregnant, they go and abort, you know, all that kind of thing. Five years, nothing showing their commitment and responsibility. And then they leave you. Then they go for Jane Wagon. You have become secondhand in the spectacle. They, they go for Jane Wagon. And then suddenly you say, me body dear, me body dear. Let me name so good dear. Let me name so good dear. Malo mole, malo mole, agbele. Uba alo mole. We are very interested. Eleven months on Fanny Hong Kong. What try all means? Open it. Obi Bisa baby, our papa walk. Children baby, our papa, and person called your list. If or your real straight, on your real, I will cry dog yourself, your bumble club straight. Sir, or your real, he will look for your father and, and take a list. It told the man he said kikra. What is a biscuit here? What shell for so? Why a car? We be bad. No tea. Not no taste. Ah, they just severe that. Oh, shortbread. That's a nice biscuit. Oh, lovely, lovely. And I mean, get us car next week. Me buy a metro. Na na. Me buy and say a ten rules. What races? Says and then so a one two one two two are eight twelve. What the four no I can no. What the at all. So next week in ban matto. Ubi anto. Why ne me? Why ne me? Me 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 biscuits is in Bangovi. Ubi anto. This is why I keep telling. Honor your husband. Don't honor your pastor. And dishonor your husband. Papa, Papa, praise him. Papa, praise him. You are the man of God. You are the man of the moment. You are the man of God. You are the anointed son of God. You are the, you know, when I see people talking like that, I say, really? If you do, you are the man of God. You are the, you are, I hear them say, you are the John the Baptist of our time. Where did you meet John the Baptist? Honor your husband. I don't bacho we di ani ni. Bacho didi mame na uteninche. Enya se ukuno didi na ufuns. Fidget. Grofu ajin grofu ukuno mu. Uhu. Uhu. Tena. Be me biya pa kro kro. Apart from respect, ano. Be me biya pa kro kro. Oye peni o kitu o biya. He is wrong, but he doesn't want you to shout. He is wrong, but he doesn't want you to shout. Hi, babe. Come on, dear. Who can boo? Hey, Briar. Briar. I don't want to say what you mean. Briar is saying. Hallelujah. Husbands, love your wives as Christ loved the church and gave himself. These are words of life. Words of hope. Eternal life will guide your way. Prepare your ways before the Lord your God. I keep telling the parents, when mommy says no, daddy cannot say yes. There must be affirmation of authority, parental authority. So you went to your mommy, and mommy says, Put up the television. Daddy can do it. So then I better let them watch. No, you have disdained your wife before your children. Your mommy, what your mommy said, that is what I will say. Finish. 
authority. And the last thing I will speak to you about is forgiveness and then we close. Forgiveness. You can't be a Christian without knowing or easily having the grace to forgive. Ubi ayo ubi it's difficult. Some of the people, they use you, you know, intentionally, despitefully. I said that maturity is equal to ignore, overlook, and forgive. Ignore, ignore. Some of the things ignore. And I keep telling these people. Somebody wrote something about you on, uh, for people like me who is always in the news and you know, people who view drug, who view drug, who view drug, who view drug. You know, what, what can make you, and this is the meaning of Shiloh, peace in the midst of pain or in the midst of confusion. They are making a lot of noise, but you are at peace. You are at peace. When I look at my president, I see that attribute. We are but he is at peace. Japan, so you know that. Hey, are you? Sorry, 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 Japan. Put that scripture back as we pray with it. Second Chronicles chapter 20. So, you know, put it in uh, maybe the last two verses, uh, versions you have now. Jotam's strength was rooted in his steady and determined life of obedience to God. Last two versions. Jotam grew powerful because he walked steadfastly before the Lord is God. And the last one, King Jotam became powerful because he was careful. Listen to that. He was careful to live in obedience to the Lord his God. Be careful to live in obedience. I said when the traffic light is red, the police is not there. The cameras are not there. But there are two people that are there. God and your conscience are there. If you can do what is right in that situation, you are careful to live in obedience to the Lord. And when I say the Lord, I'm talking about to Christ. Christ your Lord. Christ who died for you. So go home and prepare your ways. Your ex did bad and evil to you. You should be thanking him. He is your lesson for the next dimension. I'm t you should be thanking him. You should be thanking Everybody who comes into your life is a lesson. Whether they treated you good, bad, ugly, best, they are all lessons. Every encounter is a lesson. Amen. It's a lesson. Tell me truth. Tell me anyhow the truth. Give it to me. Just drop it. I will go and regurgitate it. Hallelujah. And it is this where the oil flows. The oil flows in obedience. The oil flows in where people fear God. The anointing flows when people are in readiness. Satan has no place. I can't go read you so many times. We will silence the enemy and stop him one time. By the power of the Holy Spirit. Udiyan is a prepare. She she wa bra bonne wa life. She she, she she. And yes, you are man. To everything takes time to work. Everything takes a process. If I want to cook, it will take time. If I want to drive, it will take time. Be be a bre a bre a bre a bre. Everything. If I propose to you that I want to marry you, you need 
time to think about it, to pray about it. You need time. Time. Ntinya si atine manetu. This morning, the police arrested two people who, who are printing fake money. I'm going to see a few money. A printer can come new time for now. See a few money. The moment she them now, they print a two hundred CD notes. A bit of people are like cracking their brain, brainstorming, working. Who traffic money? And it's because any brad dear, any brad dear, Messi Nikas were pewa, umpe Messi, ni upe will be our deca by yed, you know, that kind of a casism. Like I was telling you on Sunday, so we want people who say, hey, hi, chick. I will sort you out. We have lunch in Montreal and come to Zurich and have dinner. And then I will check you in at our poultry farm. Jubilee House is our poultry farm. <laughs> Jubilee House is our poultry farm. Oh. To us. People want I look at the generation preaching University of Ghana Legons. I was speaking to some of the young men. I and I'm a many young girls standing here are still single. I guess it's them. I guess it's them. And you're going to be fitting in your and we're a friend and we're a sham, not driving that. No. One more, we're a sham, no more to my bonda. I told you the truth. One more, we're a sham, no more to my bonda. I told you the truth. It would be a fan, not called Polish, near Polish, what they working on it. I won't work and maybe, you know, we're working on it. And then with time, it will work. If I had any time, yeah. Who, who did it? The woman me name it is No, I name it is Me am the first day I name Krampanya. Oh, Rollins chain. Man, what is this, man? But with time, with time, with time, grace from grace to grace, from glory to glory, from victory to victory. Yeah. It will It will be good. The life takes time. Yeah. People will, you know, they, they would look down on you, they would disdain you, they will, but it's all your learning process. Ghana, I mean, when you say, when you be, they don't even give you attention. You know, but it's just a matter of time. It's a matter of time. You are climbing. Or climbing. That's a matter of time. I have a couple of books of the passport. And I took, because it's all put together, I took it and I showed it in my first passport. In the first passport, I am in a jacket, a blazer, with tie, a colored tie, a striped shirt. And uh, I took a picture. And then I said, this picture, I took it at circle. The jacket was borrowed from the photographer. The tie was borrowed from my friend, Ibn Zalmon. And the shirt was my brother, my elder brother's shirt. And that you did, you did try a picture. A combination of borrowed things. And then I took the picture. And then I opened the second book. And in the second book, I said, in this picture, the shirts are not borrowed. But I was struggling. Even though that is a passport that has so many visas. Every page has a visa. But 
This tells you when you see so many visas and just in my year, just say, I was a hustler. I was traveling everywhere. Kakran, kakran, kakran. And then the third one has a lot of visas in it. The dresses are not borrowed. I am wearing a clerical suit. As a matter of fact, that passport was issued in London from the Ghana High Commission in London. My resident permit in London is in that one. And all that. I said, you see, after struggling, begging and all that, hustling, you come to a place of settlement. Now, a passport can be issued in even a foreign land to you because that was where you were settled. Then we came to the next one. So now I'm realizing the books are five. You came to the next one. I'm in a clerical suit in that one also. In that particular one, I have visas that I didn't travel. I couldn't have time to travel. Until recently, I got the new one attached to it. I said, this passport is a story. All together is a story. Take time. And pray with one pen, ten way. Yami brim. And then I was there. But she now almost asked her, but no more be better. It's an interesting world. It's a very interesting world. When I had the privilege to renovate Streams Ministries, their retreat center at Sukron, I did not hesitate. A day before my wedding, the bed my mother gave me is a double bed, but the mattress is one and a half. A day to my wedding, I'm bringing the day to come and sleep on that bed, because that's what I have. And every morning when I wake up, my free mattress is not to New so. So I decided, so okay, remember the dad that mattress and so for one week. Now from the next week, no one need to be honest. No one who said he'd be honest. <laughs> when I came back from my waiting, like I returned today, Mama Charity had changed my bedroom. Brand new bed, brand new bed, sheet pillows, brand new dressing, mirror, brand new rug, brand new everything. Sana, everybody has a breakthrough day. Everybody has a breakthrough day. Yours may not be today, it possibly might be tomorrow morning. Today, the 23, 523. Let God. Fast forward your breakthrough day. In the name of Jesus. You believe that? You believe that? Lift your two hands. Everything you are trusting God for. In the next 21 days. I want you to speak it to the Father. Somebody declare it. Can I hear your voice? And then we'll be closing. Come on, in the name of Jesus. Raise it up. Remember to pray for your children. Zio! Lift it, lift it, sweet. Lift it. Atanta, Agiyaloho, Arapati, Kato, Shadaba, Antu. Come on in the name of Jesus. Rabobo, Shigere, Giyanaba, Anta, Azua, Atine, Rabata, Kadiba. Lift it in the name of Jesus. Come on in Jesus' name. Alikate, Baronta, Azia, Namanana, Kosh. Pante, Gia, Suadebo, Rabadio, Hey, Kiadosh, Ramadanesh. I bring your career before God. I bring your family before God.
before the Lord. I bring your finances before God. I bring your ministry before God. I pray for you. I prophesy. I declare. I affirm the word of the Lord. Let there be a manifestation of his glory. Rantosh. There is an anointing in this building. There is a sweet, powerful grace. The presence of God is in this place. The power of God is in this place. There is fresh oil. Anything is possible. Everything is possible. There is fresh oil. Holy Ghost, in the name of Jesus. Spirit of the living God. Holy Spirit of God. Shanda di baraka. Gia! Santa! Hallelujah. For the next two minutes, sweet, let me give you an opportunity. Every demonic attempt of the enemy against your space, your life, your destiny, let God arise. Let his enemy scatter. In the name of Jesus, come on, clap these hands and pray. Holy God, I come against every power that be, every stronghold that is impeding God's people. Let God arise. Let his enemy scatter. Let me hear you, sweet. Come on. Hey! We scatter the agenda of the enemy. Any spell that is cast against you, any stumbling block set against you. I command every attack against your life to be aborted, to be thwarted, to be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Every hold of the enemy against you is broken. In the name of Jesus. I come against the frustrating devices of the wicked on this altar of fire. I declare victory is yours. In the name of Jesus, victory belongs to you. Lift your two hands and let us pray. If this is your power, if this is your glory, 
If this is your presence And let it rain If this is your power Ah uh, Then let it rain Sing it one more time If this if this is your glory, if this is your presence, then let it rain. Sing it one more time. If this, this right. oh, if this is your glory, uh, then let it rain. Let it rain. Let it rain. Let it rain. If this is your power, that's right. Then let it rain. The Lord is leading me to administer the communion to all of you. I have seen seven people at Forest and Bible Kessia who went mad. They lost their sanity. We gave them just the communion. The flesh of Christ and the blood of Christ in emblems. And instantly their insanity departed. Seven, not one. Seven. I have witnesses here. Yeah. Seven. I declare on this altar of end time fire. I declare that this is not just bread and drinks. This is the flesh of Christ and the blood of Christ. Everybody watching us online, you can go get yourself a glass of water or juice and a piece of bread, cake or biscuit and join us. I declare in the name of Jesus that everything you have prayed before the throne of God is possible. You will walk out of this place with an absolute, absolute miracle. You will go home with the miraculous and the supernatural in the name of the Lord Jesus. In Jesus' name. Let they bring the communion. Mama Lizzie, Mama Comfort, come and help me. I bless this in the name of Jesus. On the night that Christ was delivered into the hands of sinners, he took bread and gave thanks. Have you seen me having communion on Tuesday before? All right. I declare in the name of Jesus as you have led me on this altar to administer to your people the Lord is telling me there are some people that are bleeding from inside and God is telling me you have things you want to tell somebody but you can't tell anybody the spirit of God is telling me I will meet you at the point of your need you don't need to tell me. God knows it. He will sort you out. God will sort you out. God will sort you out. I declare in the name of Jesus that if this wafer touches your tongue, if this drink touches your tongue, it will be the flesh of Christ touching your spirit. I declare a revival in the name of Jesus. Healing, deliverance, restoration, restitution, recovery, replenishment. The touch of Almighty God. In the precious name of Jesus. Amen. The lady that was healed from the all night to forest in Bible. Because what was her name? What is her name? Young lady. Susan. She is also Susan. Went to work, came back, and she became damp, numbed. 
That was it. And she was like that. Then the trouble started. will manage. She started suffocating, couldn't breathe. Went to Kolibu, they did all tests, couldn't see anything. They declared her hopeless. Go home and die. They made it clear. Woman, your daughter will die. Go home and let her die. All night, third all night or fourth one, third or fourth. They brought her to the all night. The Lord touched her life. She repeatedly came to forest. I think she came to forest one. Then, then I prayed for her. Took the glory of God. She came the next Wednesday and the insanity was gone. You will encounter God tonight. I am not, I am not enthusing you. I am telling you prophetically that you will encounter God tonight. I bless this in Jesus name. Can you serve everybody communion, including children, everybody. Give everybody one of these. Then let it rain, let it. If this is your power, if this is your power. If this is your. If this is your. Then let it rain. If this is your power. If this is your, then let it rain. Let it rain. Ah. Online, I want somebody. Me pe wo bi awo wo problem. Then ya mi nji ano. Me pe wo bi awo wo problem anaji. If this is your, thank you. If this is your, I know I don't know. If this is your, then let it rain. Let it rain, let it. When you're let it. Somebody sing, let it rain, let it rain. If this is your power, uh, if this is your glory, whoa, whoa, if this is your prayer, then let it rain. If this is your power, uh, And let it rain. We will have communion and anointing within a short time and we are gone. Normally 7.30 I'm done. Latest 8 o'clock I'm done. Forgive me for tonight. Everything just turn upside down. But the Holy Spirit will bring testimonies out of it. Hallelujah. Can you get the oil ready for me? How they are still serving? Can you lift yours up? Father, I declare in the name of Jesus that these wafers and these drinks I declare the flesh of Christ and the blood of Christ separated from every earthly Ethiopia and property. I declare in the name of Jesus that it will bring supernatural visitations. Things that does not make sense to the human or cognitive comprehension. In the precious name of Christ Jesus, my Lord. I give you thanks. In Jesus' name. Amen. Open the way for Hold me close, let your love surround me.
breathe. Draw me to your side. Ah, and let I wait, relax. I rise up like the eagle to slow. Ego, and I will soar with you. Your spirit leads me on by the power of your love. Father, I declare in the name of Jesus, anybody that eats this have covenanted with you. Satan cannot come close. Oh, the devil dares not. In the name of Jesus the Christ. Amen. Eat it. Online, don't just watch. Hmm. Don't just watch. Don't just watch. What again? We're going to be here. The Bible said that the blood of Christ speaks than that of Abel. It speaks. In the name of Jesus. Now speak in just 30 seconds. Any, anything that you, you want to see, any dimension you want to assimilate. Oh, there are dimensions in Christ. Take us to the next level, Father. Shift alabaster to the next dimension. Take us to the next zenith, the next pinnacle, the next altitude, the next dimension. Online, don't just watch. This is your divine moment. Don't miss it. Hallelujah. Now can you lift the blood up and somebody declare in the name of Jesus. I am a child of God. I'm a, I am destined for all success. I am significant. I am relevant. I am the salt of the earth. The light of the world. I am anointed. I am glorified. This is my time. I am the head, not the tail. I am above, not beneath. Evil will not come near me. No weapon formed against me shall not prosper. Listen, somebody will declare this is the lab before we drink it. Declare in the name of Jesus. I shall not die before my time. I will leave. I will prosper. I will declare the works of God. As he is in heaven, so am I on earth. I am for signs and wonders. In Jesus name. Amen. Drink it. Can you dip your hand in a container like this? And anoint your head. Your head will be anointed with oil. Touch your two ears. You will not hear bad news. Touch the container the third time. Touch your eyebrow, the both of them. You will see the goodness of the Lord in the land of the living. Put your hand in the container for that. The Bible said that when the angel of death sees the blood on the door, he will pass over you. Yeah. I declare this. Whatever you came with, your bag, your wallet, whatever, let it be a point of contact of your home, of your shop, of your business, of whatever. I want to anoint that thing. I go to radio. If he works on the righteous, I will not be standing here talking to you. Oh, please. Touch that thing. You have the Lord bless you. And lastly, dip your hand in the container the last time and touch your chest or your heart. And that is for your health. Physical health. Oh, you will not be sick. Sickness is not your portion. I command your soul, your spirit, and your body to reject sickness. Every form and any kind of it. Amen. 
Run to the altar. Forget about the container. Leave it on your chair. Run to the altar. Let me anoint. And then protocol will take care of the container later. Kabadio, can you come with? Hey, how are you? Sir, good to see you. The Lord bless you. Lady Susan, thank you. This is beautiful. God bless you. In, thank you. I started with uh, the lady's song, beautiful song. Great that you love, greatly to be praised, greatly to be, Father you reign, Father. Put that song there for us. Great. I declare that this is the presence of God. May the presence of God go with you and give you victory. Receive the touch of God. Bless you. Oh, great. Bless you. Bless you, my dear. Bless you, sir. Bless you, sweet. Bless you, my dear. Bless you, bless you, bless you, bless you. Ah! Jesus. Radaba Jadahaya. Bless you. Father, you reign. Holy, holy God Almighty. Bless you. It's, it's a privilege to worship you. Ah! Jesus' Great name. Bless you, my dear. Bless you. It's a man I just to stand. Monje, with a grateful heart, I lift my hands to you. Proclaim me, Lord, you reign. Bless you. You will prosper. With a grateful heart, you will rise. You will shine. Receive it in the name of Jesus. Proclaim me, Lord, you reign. Bless you, bless you. Great is to be Father, you reign. Brava, dama, no, shada. Great is to be Bless you, bless you, sir. Bless you, sir. Bless you, yes, sir. Father, you reign. Oh, great are you, Lord. Great is to be Victory over you in the name of Father, Jesus. Great are you, Lord. Great are you, Lord. Rada Basha Dada. Wait for me. Sweet, how you love, greatly to be blessed. Sunday, when you went to school, I saw Pastor Steve turn into a drummer. So, in the picture, I said, When the Steve started playing drums, very interesting. And see, everybody is so, so much important. I saw so, so much important. Somebody was speaking to me the other day and said, um, you know, there was something that I said, leave it with my ladies at the church. And then he said, the cleanest, I said, the cleanest is me. They are my ladies. They are not cleaners. 
cleanness. They make me. They make me. Takrabuan and takran and mani. They are not cleaners. Without them, we won't be having church. Yeah. Without all these lovely people, lovely people, you know, we will not be transmitting to the world. Yeah. So I I treasure all these guys so much. So much. Hallelujah. In my prayer this afternoon, I have seen a revelation four times. And it's a revelation of this lady's husband. Where is he working? Kenya say. And also was where Oyare. Debbie, I want us to pray for him. Memuno said diabetes has hit three people very strong. Your husband, I see Pastor Adam standing here right now. Diabetes hit him. He's wearing the police uniform. But I see him shrinking in the uniform. I don't want to joke with this revelation. No. No, no, no. So, uh, yeah. I want to pray for you. Serious, on your health. I won't joke with your health at all. Because I will not be taking chances at all. But only one minute. Only one minute. These are demonic spirits and wicked. I come against every power risen against your husband. He shall not die. Life. I bless you. You deliver Pastor Adam from evil. You are preserved. You are preserved. I break the hold of the enemy from your life. In Jesus' precious name. Amen. The Lord bless you. Unim. Somebody is standing here. You went to the hospital between 10 days now. They have told you something. I counter that something. In the name of Jesus. We overturn the report of men. I declare victory over your soul. In Jesus name. Amen and amen. Bless your children. Bless them. Jesus name. Amen. Before we go home. The number 23. Today is 23, 5, 23. 23. Whether it's 23 cities, 230. Whether it is 2,300. Whatever. Those of you watching online, $23, 230, 2,030. Number 23 is very significant. It's 23 cities. You want to give that as an offering. 2,300. If it's 230, whatever. But 23. Ebrus are fine, but it can be less. 23. You want to honor God this night? 23. Twenty-three. Anything twenty-three. Well, one of the me you Tuesday. Twenty-three near my make a Twenty-three. A bro twenty-three and so are fine. Wouldn't it be in so are fine? You wouldn't be so wouldn't it be Anna? Wouldn't it be? It's fine. Anna wam wam hosa. Let me put it that way. It's fine. I declare in the precious name of Jesus that your seed will speak on the altar for you. In the name of Jesus. Now give your seed an assignment. Anything you are believing God for, for just five seconds, speak it to that seed. Ah, sister. You know that I'm not doing this because of money. If it is money, I will not be preaching for the past six years. Every Tuesday, I'm here. Every Sunday, W3 has received only one guest, Mama Christie. 
since we started in 2016 every Sunday I'm preaching if it is money I will be in America and UK I will not desert there Sean come here and say I'm here to Lord bless you. Come to the altar. Engage the altar. The Lord bless. God bless. God bless. That is the only offering we are taking. We won't take any offering again. Stand to your feet. Let's close. Thank you for coming. We love you. Forgive me of the time. This is a special service. Amen. Father, you reign. Apart from this, do we have more? We have more. All right. Yeah, great. If you have any sick relative at home, you have somebody at home or in a hospital, give this to them. Take one and give it to them. No, take one and give it to them. Father, you reign great. Great, thank you. And greatly to, I have one more. I'm a police. You want one? I will give you one. Don't worry. God bless you, ma'am. Thank you. Okay, your two hands are on your heart. Let us pray. Everybody online, thank you for joining us. We love you. From all of us here in the Isaac and Bonsa Memorial Temple. God richly bless you for joining us. Tomorrow, don't miss Dan Kwansam on United Television, uh, which is airing at 5.30 to 6. On Thursday at Atinga TV, 6 uh, 5 o'clock to 6. Uh, and God will bless you. I'll be on the radio from 5, 5 a.m. to 6 on OK 101.7 FM. When righteousness becomes a lifestyle, breakthroughs, it becomes automatic. May the Lord bless you. I love you. See you next time. You can make a redemption of time wisely and prudentially. This is not a time anybody can be joking. It's a very precarious and perilous time. Therefore, the preachers of this generation cannot go to sleep. Because the moment we start sleeping, the enemies, the enemy will be sowing tears among us. As I'm speaking to you right now, he will gather the nations together, the goats and the sheep. Even nations are going to be celebified, segmented. Here, go there. You come here. It's coming. That means that when the word of the Lord is preached, the people that receive the word ought to repent. There must be a transformation of the word. Which nation among the world has more prophets than this one? Ask me which other nation also in the world are more cruel and wicked on this continent than this one? There are people sitting here with deals. Serious deals. You can talk about fraudulent criminal deals. Thousand beside us sitting in church, polished with makeup. How will the prophets of Ghana stand before the Son of Man? and answer to him we sold red blue oil so polo stickers and handbands that was what we were doing bring Christ back
bring Jesus back to his church. We have become like Laodicea who have hijacked the church. Laodicea. The church that can speak truth. You tell truth to people, they will leave church. I will tell you truth for you to leave. I will tell you truth for you to leave. Make me preach in the crowd your best to some babies. Your pebe be a best to say Shamaniso. Or pebe be a best to some in Sanomso. They are looking for places for compromise. That is Babylon. Babylonish is a compromise. Compromise. That you don't see. When Kofi Uru is standing here, you can't see his heart. You can't see his motives. You can't see his conscience. But that is what God will be judging. He calls it deeds and works yeah your motives your what drives you to do what you do yeah your temperament your attitude your character he is calling you to a place of repentance to break away all the addictions away from your life Creating as a clean heart, renew a right spirit, cast us not from your presence, take not your spirit from us, restore unto us the joy of your salvation, renew a right spirit. Time has come for judgment to begin in the house of God because the house of God have been turned into the den of thieves. The house of God have been turned into a, a pivot of exploitation, deception, manipulation, seduction. The house of God have been a place of ridicule. The house of God have been turned into playing grounds for charlatans to come and display their words. The house of God has turned into the place where we showcase and exhibit flesh and carnality. The house of God now has become the place where the people go to hear nonsense and madness. The house of God now has turned into the place where the people go to chase girls and, and go and snatch husbands and go and snatch people's wives. The house of God has 